As a Middle Eastern American, I've been watching the news. I watch it from that point of view. I look for, uh, you know, uh, for biases in there. I was watching the news last year. There was this plot to blow up JFK Airport. I was watching the news. I was like, please don't be Middle Eastern. Please don't be Middle Eastern. And the news came out that said they're Guyanese. I was like, yes! Those damn Guyanese! You can't trust them. You can't trust the Guyanese. I don't even know where that is. But you can't trust them. But then the next day the news came out that said, but they're Muslim. I was like, damn! I was like, just once, can it be another religion? Just once. Just once, couldn't it be a Buddhist? Just once. But then I thought about it, it will never be a Buddhist, right? Because the Buddhists live in the moment, right? A Buddhist would be like, I was gonna blow myself up. <laughs> but that moment is gone. <laughs> I am in another moment right now. <laughs> I don't feel very explosive. <laughs> I feel like dancing, I feel like dancing right now. In the news. This was in the news. Last year, there was an airplane leaving Minneapolis airport. There were six imams outside the plane. They were praying before they got on the plane. The passenger saw them praying, freaked out, told the pilot, and the pilot kicked them off the plane. And I heard that, and I thought to myself, I'm pretty sure the job of Al-Qaeda is to lay low <laughs> before getting on the plane. Right? Al-Qaeda's not gonna be praying before they get on the plane. Right? They're not gonna run around the airport going <laughs> before they get on the plane. Right? I'm not worried about the guys praying before they get on the plane. I'm worried about the guy who's trying to blend in too hard. Right? I'm worried about the guy who's coming up going like, Hey, buddy! How about those Yankees? They will win the Super Bowl this year. I'll be like, that's your guy right there! This was on 60 Minutes last year. 60 Minutes did a piece on the U.S. Navy. The U.S. Navy fired some Arabic translators who were American, but they were doing Arabic translations. They fired them because they found out they were gay. Yeah, there's a don't ask, don't tell policy in the military. They found out they're gay. They fired them. I heard that and I thought to myself, what are we afraid of? What, are they going to gay up the translation? <laughs> right? When they be like, okay, I hear some chatter. There's gonna be a bombing at the embassy. <laughs> and a sale at Prada. Oh my God! 